Hello, my name is Bilal Ghalib. We are building a laser cutter. The Royal Wii. As you see, so this is how we're going to make the print head. We have a two inch cube of wood and then this nice piece of um, three eighths of an inch aluminum tubing and a three eighths of an inch aluminum rod. Uh, cut the rod to the size of your board and cut two inches of the aluminum tubing twice so that you have these two guys over here. Um, next, what you're going to do is set them up so that one direction will control your X and you got to make sure that it's um, perpendicular and flat on the piece of wood. And then the other one is going to control your Y. You're going to want to put them something like this so that they have space in, uh, in between and that's going to uh, slide you around in both directions. We're going to fix them with these copper brackets that they use for holding copper tubing to the <clears throat> uh, ceiling of your basement. Okay, this is my laboratory. It's a kitchen which now that the people are away doing Christmassy kind of stuff I've converted into my lab alright let's get ready to so come over here with our old Windows 98 machine we actually have some code to show ya let's evaluate it all it does is it runs through and it outputs on our serial port right over here with the first four data pins uh, a series of signals which control the stepper motor in our lovely scanner to step first clockwise and then counterclockwise what we have over here is a what is it? ULN 2800 right? And that basically allows us to take in 12 volts from here and output it instead of the, the whatever, 5 volts coming from the computer. So we have 5 volts coming in here, but we want 8 volts, or 12 volts. So we have the uh, ULN guy, he's called a driver, taking care of that for us. Okay, so ULN, show us what you are working with. Clockwise. I'm just going to do this 250 times. Okay, we're going to hit my breadboard. Oh, no, we won't. 